Ja, was haben wir hier? Praktische Panzerung. Ich warte mit denen nochmal. Also verrate ich schon mal, Garrus ist einer der besten Charaktere im Spiel einfach. Your biotics are impressive, Lieutenant. I'm surprised that humans stop using the L2 configuration with results like yours. My addicts can be pretty bad, and I'm one of the lucky L2 implants. The L3s are safer. Humanity will be judged by the sacrifices its people are willing to make, Lieutenant. The Turians would have kept the L2 implants. Ich finde das echt geil, wenn mein Hund einfach mal still wäre. Witnesses saw you making threats in Fist's bar. Stay away from him. I don't take orders from you. This is your only warning, Rex. You should warn Fist. I will kill him. You want me to arrest you? I want you to try. Go on. Get out of here. Do I know you, human? My name's Shepard. I'm going after Fist. Thought you might want to come along. <sighs> Shepard. Commander Shepard. I've heard a lot about you. We're both warriors, Shepard. Out of respect, I'll give you a fair warning. I'm going to kill Fist. Fist knows you're coming. We'll have a better chance if we all work together. My people have a saying. Seek the enemy of your enemy, and you will find a friend. Glad to have you on the team, Rex. Let's go. I hate to keep Fist waiting. So, Rex ist übrigens auch einer der wenigen mit einer guten deutschen Synchronstimme. Nur die haben sie leider viel zu leise gestellt. Man hört ihn kaum. Äh, jetzt muss ich überlegen, von wo kamen wir. In light of the recent attack on Eden Prime, many colonial investors are pulling their support for future projects. Proponents of expanded human colonization insist that Eden Prime was an isolated case. Nevertheless, colonist enrollment has dropped sharply. Many colonial proposals are on hold until backers have some reassurance that human colonies will be adequately protected. Ja, die Fahrstuhlmusik ist auch offenbar ein Remix von dem restlichen Soundtrack. Habe ich schon gewundert, warum sie mir bekannt vorkommt. Ähm. So, wo haben wir denn mal hier eine... Präsidium, nein, da wollte ich eigentlich nicht hin. Ins Flachs wollte ich auch nicht.
Да. Looks like it shut down. Fist knows we're coming. Take cover! Ah, Rex hat eine Barriere, okay. Stimmt, der ist ja Biotica. Ähm, Garrus, was kannst du? Kannst Sabotage. Ja, ruhig. So, den übernehmen wir zusammen. So, Kogana Tisch, der ist tot. Vielleicht haben wir irgendwo noch seinen Bruder Kogana Krieger. Also ich weiß, dass es auch Kogana Krieger gab. Stop right there. Don't come any closer. Warehouse workers. All the real guards must be dead. Stay back or we'll shoot. This would be a good time to find somewhere else to work. Yeah, yeah, right. That's a good idea. Yeah, I never like fist anyway. It would have been quicker to just kill them. Shooting people isn't always the answer. Das holen wir uns mal. Fuck. Ey, ich bin noch mit diesem Heck Minispiel auch absolut schrecklich. Ich wieder kaum. Super. Where's the Quarian? She's not here. I don't know where she is. That's the truth. He's no use to you now. Let me kill him. Wait, wait. I don't know where the Quarian is, but I know where you can find her. The Quarian isn't here. Said you'd only deal with the Shadow Broker himself. Face to face? Impossible. Even I was hired through an agent. Nobody meets the Shadow Broker. Ever. Even I don't know his true identity. But she didn't know that. I told her I'd set a meeting up. But when she shows up, it'll be Saren's men waiting for her. Give me the location. Now. Here on the wards. The back alley by the markets. She's supposed to meet them right now. You can make it if you hurry. What are you doing? The Shadow Broker paid me to kill him. I don't leave jobs half done. We don't shoot unarmed prisoners. How many people died because of him? He brought this on himself. Besides, we have more pressing concerns. That Quarian's dead if we don't go now. Ja, vier Minuten haben wir. Oh 
waren diese ganzen Sachen vorhin? Ja, Rex tankt die mal so ein bisschen. Doof. Doch hier. Did you bring it? Where's the shadow broker? Where's Fist? They'll be here. Where's the evidence? No way. The deal's off. Couldn't trust him. Were you hurt in the fight? I know how to look after myself. Not that I don't appreciate the help. Who are you? My name's Shepard. I'm looking for evidence to prove Saren's a traitor. Then I have a chance to repay you for saving my life. But not here. We need to go somewhere safe. We could take her to the human embassy. Your ambassador will want to see this anyway. You're not making my life easy, Shepard. Firefights in the wards, an all-out assault on Korra's den. Do you know how many... Who's this? A Quarian? What are you up to, Shepard? Making your day, Ambassador. She has information linking Saren to the Geth. Really? Maybe you better start at the beginning, Miss... My name is Tali. Tali Zora Naraya. We don't see many Quarians here. Why did you leave the flotilla? I was on my pilgrimage. My rite of passage into adulthood. I've never heard of this before. It is a tradition among my people. When we reach maturity, we leave the ships of our parents and our people behind. Alone, we search the stars, only returning to the flotilla once we have discovered something of value. In this way, we prove ourselves worthy of adulthood. What kinds of things do you look for? It could be resources like food or fuel, or some type of useful technology, or even knowledge that will make life easier on the flotilla. Through our pilgrimage, we prove that we will contribute to the community, rather than being a burden on our limited resources. Tell us what you found. During my travels, I began hearing reports of Geth. Since they drove my people into exile, the Geth have never ventured beyond the Vale. I was curious. I tracked a patrol of Geth to an uncharted world. I waited for one to become separated from its unit. Then I disabled it and removed its memory core. I thought the Geth fried their memory cores when they died. Some kind of defense mechanism. How did you manage to preserve the memory core? My people created the Geth. If you're quick, careful, and lucky, small caches of data can sometimes be saved. Most of the core was wiped clean. But I salvaged something from its audio banks. Eden Prime was a major victory. The beacon has brought us one step closer to finding the conduit. That's Saren's voice. This proves he was involved in the attack. Die Röhre. Noch so ein Grund, warum ich die deutsche Synchro verabscheue. He said Eden Prime brought him one step closer to finding the conduit. Any idea what that means? The conduit must have something to do with the beacon. Maybe it's some kind of Prothean technology. Like a weapon. Wait, there's more. Saren wasn't working alone. Eden Prime was a major victory. 
The beacon has brought us one step closer to finding the conduit. And one step closer to the return of the Reapers. I don't recognize that other voice, the one talking about Reapers. Are they some kind of new alien species? According to the Memory Core, the Reapers were a hyper-advanced machine race that existed 50,000 years ago. The Reapers hunted the Protheans to total extinction, and then they vanished. At least, that's what the Geth believe. Sounds a little far-fetched. The vision on Eden Prime. I understand it now. I saw the Protheans being wiped out by the Reapers. The Geth revere the Reapers as gods, the pinnacle of non-organic life. And they believe Saren knows how to bring the Reapers back. The Council is just going to love this. They won't believe you anyway. Just keep them out of this. We have to tell them. Even if they don't believe anything else, this proves Saren is a traitor. The Captain's right. We need to present this to the Council right away. What about her? The Quarian? My name is Tali. You saw me in the alley, Commander. You know what I can do. Let me come with you. I thought you were on your pilgrimage. The pilgrimage proves we are willing to give of ourselves for the greater good. What does it say about me if I turn my back on this? Saren is a danger to the entire galaxy. My pilgrimage can wait. I'll take all the help I can get. Thanks. You won't regret this. Anderson and I will go ahead to get things ready with the Council. Take a few minutes to collect yourself, then meet us in the tower. <laughs> So, die zwei werde ich wohl die meiste Zeit als Squad Marine dabei haben. Nee, mit dem will ich nicht reden. Excuse me, Commander Shepard. Could you spare a moment of your time? Ähm, nein. So viel ich weiß, bist du eine nicht bedeutende Nebenquest und damit... Nein, die Zeit habe ich nicht. Come on. Udin is presenting the Quarian's evidence to the Council. Eden Prime was a major victory. The beacon has brought us one step closer to finding the conduit. And one step closer to the return of the Reapers. You wanted proof? There it is. This evidence is irrefutable, Ambassador. Saren will be stripped of his Spectre status and all efforts will be made to bring him in to answer for his crimes. I recognize the other voice, the one speaking with Saren. Matriarch Benezia. Who's she? Matriarchs are powerful Asari who have entered the final stage of their lives. Revered for their wisdom and experience, they serve as guides and mentors to my people. Matriarch Benezia is a powerful biotic and she had many followers. She will make a formidable ally for Saren. I'm more interested in the Reapers. What do you know about them? Only what was extracted from the Geth's memory core. The Reapers were an ancient race of machines that wiped out the Protheans. Then they vanished. The Geth believe the Reapers are gods, and Saren is the prophet for their return. We think the Conduit is the key to bringing them back. Saren's searching for it. That's why he attacked Eden Prime. Do we even know what this Conduit is? Saren thinks it can bring back the Reapers. That's bad enough. Listen to what you're saying. Saren wants to bring back the machines that wiped out all life in the galaxy? Impossible. It has to be. Where did the Reapers go? Why did they vanish? How come we found no trace of their existence? If they were real, we'd have found something. I tried to warn you about Saren, and you refused to face the truth. Don't make the same mistake again. This is different. 
You proved Saren betrayed the Council. We all agree he's using the Geth to search for the Conduit, but we don't really know why. The Reapers are obviously just a myth, Commander. A convenient lie to cover Saren's true purpose. A legend he is using to bend the Geth to his will. Fifty thousand years ago, the Reapers wiped out all galactic civilization. If Saren finds the Conduit, it will happen again. Saren is a rogue agent on the run for his life. He no longer has the rights or resources of a Spectre. The Council has stripped him of his position. That is not good enough! You know he's hiding somewhere in the Traverse. Send your fleet in! A fleet cannot track down one man. A Citadel fleet could secure the entire region, keep the Geth from attacking any more of our colonies. Or it could trigger a war with the Terminus systems. We won't be dragged into a galactic confrontation over a few dozen human colonies. I can take Saren down. The Commander's right. There is 